Johnson are a family owned um, construction business. It's actually our uh, 80th year. We've been around since um, 1937. The work, fairly diverse work in terms of the projects that we carry out and it's anything from the um, big um, recycling and energy recovery facilities which will uh, be a uh, 90 million pound uh, construction value to us through schools, um, supermarkets, so chemical industrial plants um, and then um, industrial and commercial distribution centres such as we're building here at, um, at Red House. About 10 years ago um, we would have um, quality, safety and environment um, you know, all seen in a, in, a, in a similar vein and we would put the environment and the um, quality together, single manager, um, as the workload was increasing he needed some assistance particularly with site auditing mm -hmm. so um, he actually looked for and found EMS to come and help us with some uh, with the site auditing. Um, we just needed um, um, more competent, better qualified resource um, we could have gone and found that in-house or tried to recruit, but I think to have um, an external um, um, organisation with specialists is, is just the, the right solution. From a, um, from, a, from a knowledge, from a competence uh, point of view, then uh, having an external organisation, um, you, you, you're able to, um, uh, you know, I'll say, understand legislation, have specialists, keep up with the legislation, and then the flexibility. So um, the fact that, um, you know, if we need a particular resource, but just for a short period of time, or we need a very specialist resource, um, you know, we can, uh, you, you can provide that. You know, we've always um, called you the, uh, the the environmental manager. Okay, sometimes it gets a, a virtual put in front of it, but um, we describe you as we talk to talk to people as a, as the environmental manager. And at that, I then see that um, they, they see you very much part of the the team. Um, you know, over the years, the relationship's grown, and uh, definitely, you know, I see places around the business where that they pick up the phone and look to you for uh, for support and uh, and advice. So the first first one has got to be um, knowledge and environmental um, knowledge. Um, you look at some of our construction sites, um, you know, where we're needing discharge consents and um, uh, U1 exemptions and the likes, and uh, and that knowledge is definitely uh, fundamental. Um, but then from there on in, um, you know, it's looking at our approach. Um, you go and look at the sites where we're using the uh, material management plans now and the clay plans, and um, so 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 without doubt it gives us um, commercial benefit, re re resource benefit, um, definitely um, you know, good value. The, the requirement to, to comply is fundamental um, but at the end of the day then I think um, the, the wider range of, of what EMS can do for us does help us keep up with, um, with, with good practice. Um, so we're not, we're not the biggest, um, so I don't think we expect to be at the cutting edge, but certainly um, you know, I'd like to think we're somewhere in that uh, upper quartile and uh, definitely having um, AMS on board has, has helped to keep us in that place in terms of uh, environmental performance. It's only flexed one way, I think, at the moment, isn't it? Because <laughs> we've, grown, we've grown and we've just needed more and more. Um, I suppose la last year a little bit we just t turned it down and um, t t you know tried to re re reduce the requirement and therefore the cost. So uh, yes, you know I, I certainly see that, uh, that as an advantage. But I suppose from both of our perspectives, it'll be good if we both keep growing and um, and it um, flexes up more than down. <laughs> through the training and, the, and, and working together um, we can see that people get on board, understand the importance of, uh, of environment and, um, and have some ownership of it. You know, we're looking to have good practice and we're looking to find ways of um, being effective uh, in terms of our environmental management and even efficient and, uh, and competitive. We, we, we value the relationship we've got with EMS and I see that EMS have a similar vein, you know, where they understand the importance of, uh, of people and relationships and, um, and, and work at it hard and, uh, and, and get the results because of it. Mm -hmm.